what was what was it like growing up with Jerry Garcia in your living room with your dad? Man, it was it was just a part of my reality as a small person and and something that just felt so familiar and at home and um you know, I've, I've had a lot of time to reflect on how special th that time was and I think the reason it was so special is because our family always gave Jerry the space to just be a normal person, you know, just a regular guy, which he ultimately was. And he was really in love with music in the same way that my dad is. And, and that's something that, you know, that's probably the, the greatest gift anybody's ever given to me is just a passion for music. And, um, you know, those guys like to play tunes in our living room and th then take them downstairs when they were sort of refined enough and, and put them on tape. Um, and they didn't really have any rules and, and it was really a mellow thing. And often Jerry would just show up and then my dad would call the rest of the band and Dave Dennison, the engineer over. And, you know, that's how a recording session would. Jerry's to... here. Let's go. Tape's rolling. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Cause you know, my dad, um built the studio in our basement in like 1989 and that was right around the time that he and jerry kind of rekindled their friendship and jerry knew that he would need some sort of excuse kind of to like go over there and and continue to make music and so immediately he suggested that they make a record and my dad you know he's a straight shooter and he's you know not scared and despite the business realities of the grateful dead and their business history he just said well hey man i i just built a, a recording studio and started a record company and at this point he had like one release scheduled and maybe one out or maybe not even I, i'm mm -hmm. not sure if, if the, that garcia grisman release might have been the first might have been the first the, the one with the pink and black the, cover yeah the purple one and yeah. Jerry was just super kind and righteous about it. And, you know, 